What's what do you miss the most? I miss the people. I miss my fans. You know, I miss the city. But um, you know, I, my bones don't hurt as much anymore. But I, I do miss it. I I watch every game on TV. I listen to you guys a lot, and um, you know, I always be a giant forever. We know that always. You just happen to pick the Dodgers to come back. I always pick the Dodgers <laughs> to come back. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It's just something to, about that whole giant Dodger rivalry, and it's um, you know, it's always been special for the fans, and it's always going to be special to me. Now, when you took the field at Dodger Stadium, I mean, they were a little rough on you. Did you yeah. like it? I loved it. You know, it's like I try to tell people, you know. Now they always ask me, you know, you're so different, you know, than when you were as a player. And I said, you know, I created that character out there, you know, and that was the only way I could sell tickets. They weren't buying it for my ability. <laughs> well, so I, had to cre I created that character out there so that I'd sell tickets. April 16th, you might remember this. Hey, hey. It was Barry Bonds facing Eric Gagne. Oh. <laughs> Center field, hit low, this baby's going to go out of here at 100 miles per hour. Wow. <laughs> Greatest at bat I ever yeah, saw. We, we, yeah. we talk about that at bat a lot, and, and I'm sure you do too, but we always like to revisit it. The guy threw 100 miles an hour. Right. It's. I mean, there's a catcher behind home plate. I can catch it. <laughs> All I did was use a different object to catch it. I used the bat. And I caught it, and I caught it right over there in center field. You had to have known that he was going to try to come in. I, I had a feeling that he was going to do it. I mean, they were winning at the time, and, and, and you know, Gagne's success has been successful. He did, you know, there was nothing for him to lose in that situation, and um, he got three and two, and we kind of had a little thing going back and forth saying, one, you know, you got to you got to come at me eventually and you know he, he had the great change up and he threw the great curveball and you know he wasn't going to give up the big hit to me and I, I respected that that was his job but that was a situation where I just felt that this is going to be the battle between the two of us and he was looking at me like if you hit it you name it and I named it. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> I mean but every pitch but was I didn't nasty. name all of them. He got me a couple of times too. Uh, I just I mean, got that was... one.